What's going on, everybody? Dogman Dan here. Uh, update 20.1.0 is out. I did a quick little video on this uh, Twitch streaming pom prominence bundle. Um, will be a link in the description. Going to that uh, that blog post that they put up, which basically, in short, you can now buy items through Twitch from people that stream. Um, there is a small list of Twitch partners there <clears throat> that will actually receive 5% um, of your donation directly to them, while the rest of us do not get that because we're not actual Twitch partners themselves. So you'll see that uh, if you were to purchase through anything through one of those like 10 partners that are out there, um, you'll see that a portion of the proceeds will go to so and so. Um, and if you are on a page with one of your people, with one of the people that you follow that are on Twitch and you don't see that, then they're not making anything off of it. Just FYI. Um, but you can still buy stuff from them, but they're not going to get any kind of a donation from it. Like me, I wouldn't get anything from it. Nothing surprising there. Um, and there's several other people out there that um, I'm actually surprised don't have their names up and, and aren't partnered that do stream but anyway so there's that um, and then there is the come over get over there you come over here and you've got the uh, what is it the chroma dynasty collection uh, there are 225 here it is that's what it looks like boy does that look heavily 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 Chinese determined dominant creation type of thing influenced if you will and of course why wouldn't it since they did sell the whole fucking company to the Li Yu right I mean why wouldn't they have their own creative control now I'm not saying that it's a bad looking thing but there it is uh, it is definitely influenced you can see it um I'm going to have a video this weekend. I'm going to get some time to put one together. It's going to be a very lengthy one talking about where I stand with the game, where I see the game going, in my personal opinions, you know, how I how I am. So it'll be slightly long-winded, but I'm going to get some deep detail about it. Some people may find it interesting. Some people are probably going to disagree with me. Other people will probably hate me when I release it, but I'm going to do it anyway. But this is the Chroma skin because this is this is what we get on our updates. We get new skins or weapons that are basically reskinned because of the same damn thing. You use the same weapon mods every single time, even when you're trying to make different setups. You still use the same mods. Nothing ever changes. Um, but that's it. We got this. This was the update here. You know that, and then you've got the the Twitch stuff. That's out there. Um, which actually, if I come over here for full disclosure, because you guys know I like to do that, uh, Warframe Partners did receive the Chroma Dynasty collection. New alert marked on navigation, Tenno. And Warframe Partners did get this Twitch prominence bundle, which is color palette, Ancros uh, prominence skin, and the Excalibur prominence skin. Again, you can get this by simply buying stuff through Twitch. You'll be able to get the 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 bundle, if you will. Uh, because in the end of the day, it's all about making money, and that is something that you're going to see a lot more of. The whole money thing coming into play. And well, like I said, I'll talk about that a bit over the weekend when I've got some time. just wanted to make this quick update for you. Um... I'm sorry, I, I would normally have a lot of gameplay going, you know, but quite frankly, I'm not in the mood to do any kind of game mode right now, if you will. And I believe that Barrow Katir is up again this week, so yeah, if you got your ducats for that crap, I think he's here tomorrow. I don't know. We'll see. When I get home from work, uh, I'll take a look at it and get back to you guys, if I'm in the mood. Wow, Dan, this is a completely different you. This is not what I expected from an update video. Well, guess what, people? I like to keep it real. 
Always will. And of course, you know, we've got these awesome glyphs from some partners. Um, and yep, that one did get updated from Alex from uh, the guys of France. That's his new glyph, by the way. Uh, replacing the old one. I think that one's pretty cool looking as well. Uh, Zia Rose, of course. Warframe Madness. And then mine. Which I can never get over. And what makes these great, just, just to kind of tell you what makes these great is not that I've got something that you don't have because I am happy to give you codes uh, so everybody can have one of these what makes these great if for every partner is that we can give something to people <coughs> excuse me something that we've created and we've been allowed to put into the game and is our personality as extension of us uh, and that we can share that with you that's what makes these great um, and you'll find very few games out there that have something available like that from partners to regular players but um, more on that in another video anyway for now I'll catch you guys later thanks for tuning in